Most aeration equipment in use today utilize compressed air systems. The air is pumped into the water using powerful motors to provide an oxygen source for the aerobic bacteria, which are used to treat the waste water. These bacteria break down and convert the organic waste materials which contaminate the water into substances that have a positive impact on the environment. The air bubbles are introduced into the water by forcing compressed air through a fine pore diffuser. The water then requires agitation to circulate the air throughout the lagoon in order to supply the bacteria with oxygen. The amount of oxygen required to process the waste material is referred to as the BOD, or Biological Oxygen Demand. To meet the BOD, the government requires that 2,000 to 3,000 cubic feet of air be added per pound of BOD in order to reach the oxygen content required by the aerobic bacteria. This means that for every pound of BOD, it requires roughly 2 pounds of oxygen to meet this requirement. Oxygen transfer efficiency refers to the efficiency of a system to transfer oxygen into the water. Oxygen is transferred from the surface of the bubble into the water as it rises through the water. Experimental results with conventional systems have shown that the minimum bubble sizes generated are greater than 3 to 4 millimeters in diameter. Since bubbles of this size quickly rise to the surface, the aerobic bacteria in the water are only left with about 5.7% of the oxygen that had been introduced into the water. The rest of the oxygen escapes back into the atmosphere when the bubble reaches the surface of the water. This new, fine bubble diffusion system pulls wastewater up from the bottom and then, using a physics principle called the hydraulic paradox, it shatters the surface tension of the water. This creates an imbalance in pressure, which pulls air into the water like a vacuum. An added benefit of this design is the savings in energy costs. The fine bubble diffuser only requires a two horsepower motor to operate. It also removes the need to agitate the water because the oxygen diffuses through the system naturally. Diffusion refers to the process where particles of a higher concentration tend to move to an area of lesser concentration until the particles are evenly distributed. The bubbles created by this system are so small that they cannot float out of the water. They remain suspended in the water for about four to six hours where the bubbles are able to be dissolved into the water or until they unite with enough other small air bubbles that they gain the buoyancy needed to overcome the pressure of the surrounding water. Because this new design places approximately 103 million bubbles per cubic foot into the water, which works out to about 185 square feet of surface area, and because of the amount of time that this surface area is in contact with the water, greater than 80% of the oxygen that is pumped through the system is made available to the aerobic bacteria. With an oxygen transfer efficiency of more than 80% generated by the fine bubble diffuser, the bacteria are able to grow at their maximum rate and process all of the organic waste material while providing a sizable reduction in energy costs and promoting a healthier environment.